These hunters were patiently waiting for their shot when they got a little surprise. Hey, hey. <laughs> what do you, what the heck do you do? Don't move. At 30 feet off the ground, if this bear goes on the attack, they have nowhere to go. Man, that was close. All right, let's take that back to the beginning. These two are high up in a tree stand, which is supposed to give them an advantage over their prey. Sorry guys, not today. You'll find black bears in 40 of the 50 states. This guy's gotta be at least five feet tall, and I'm betting he's around 200 pounds, and it still just took four seconds to scale that tree. There are few things scarier than a bear in your face. It might be prepping for an attack, or more likely just a little curious. I know which one I'd be hoping for. <laughs> and hear that rapid huffing and staccato sounds? Those vocalizations are bear talk for get off my property. Now look how effortlessly he holds onto this tree. That's thanks to his short curved claws. They're hooked, perfect for climbing and killing things, of course. Tribes from the Great Plains to the Pacific Northwest honor the bear for its bravery, strength, and leadership. The chiefs of some Native American tribes wore massive bear claw necklaces and believed bears could heal their own wounds. So a bear claw might be worn to protect a warrior and offer him strength. Black bears can become dangerous when they develop a taste for human food. They'll get more daring and even more aggressive looking for it. So it's smart that these guys don't have any provisions on them. <laughs> As big as he is, he looks like just a cub by comparison. I think I have to change my And who knows, maybe he was just playing hide and seek with mom all along. 